gyms are closed, but lucky me, I was ready for the apocalypse. I stopped up on all the finest gym equipment, from the squat rack, the punching bag, the curl bar, and other accessories. Join me as I take you through a tour of the Silla Cave. Up first, we have the luxurious squat rack, aka the thigh builder slash the chest builder. That's what I call it. You know. Anyways, um, I got this on Amazon for about 300 bucks. It's a small one. It holds 800 pounds though. I can easily squat in it, bench in it, and get absolutely huge. Anyways, um, I also added the American flag, because every home gym has to have an American flag. That's a law, I didn't make it up, actually I did, but it should be a law. This is America. Also, get yourself, get you, get you a bench. This bench was with the rack, so $300. You get the rack, pull up bar, and you get the bench. Now this bench is amazing. This bench can incline, decline, and go flat, of course, like um, my butt. And um, you know, you can also do sit-ups on it. You could roll it out of the way, put it on a wall if you want to. It's, it's just an amazing bench. I don't like it because at the end it starts to go go inward but hey you know it works it holds me holds the weight I hold the weight I get massive and that's what matters all right the next big piece of equipment that you're gonna need is gonna be a barbell this barbell I got on Amazon for my birthday I didn't pay anything for it but my dad did about 200 bucks when it comes to barbells, that's a good price. Because this thing is gonna wanna you're gonna wanna make this thing last. Um you're gonna wanna make sure that it's got good bear bearings in it. It's got a good spin to it. And uh also make sure it has good knurling. The knurling is important because when you grab it you want it to almost hook into your calluses. And make new ones. Calluses make a man. Um, the other thing is make sure that it can hold a good amount of weight. This one holds 1,500 pounds, you know, so I'm, I don't plan on breaking it anytime soon or going over that weight ever, although I am pretty huge. Um, yeah, you can do just about, you're going to need to do this with everything that you have for the rack except the clubs. You can do bench, squat, deadlift bent over rows, barbell curls, which I don't even do in my own gym. Don't, don't curl in the squat rack, that's, that's silly. Um, shoulder press, yeah, it, it, it's, it's a very, it's, yeah, it's a barbell. Oh, 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 hello there. I didn't, I didn't see that, I was just, uh, you, yeah. This is my punching bag and speed bag. Um, these aren't essential. It's just me flexing a bit, you know, flexing my, uh, my, my home gym equipment. Yeah. The next thing you finna need is gonna be some, I don't know what you're gonna call it, dumbbells of course for your biceps and, I don't know, shoulders and all that whatnot. Um, 
Yeah, I, I just inherited these. My dad had them for like, I don't know, before I was born. And um, they're not too heavy. I, I use them for my shoulders. So I got... Giant shoulders, but... You know, I, I like to do some light work to keep it, keep it big. And um, also, you might want one of these, a uh, hex bar. That way you can do your bicep curls real nice. Um, once again, that was inherited. My dad probably had that for, I don't know, 70 years. Um, and yeah, I, I use it a lot and I, I get huge. Oh, yeah. Gotta get thick. Mm. Oh. You're filming. Good. Um, the next thing that you gotta get is not an essential for a home gym. It's just a nice touch, a nice little, nice little icing on the cake, you know, it is a bicep blaster. I got this thing at size up for like 25 bucks. And um, all it does is isolate your biceps when you work out and you look super cool walking around with it. Oh, there you are. And then the final thing that I gotta, gotta tell you guys about, get you some cardio equipment. This thing is a bike that's probably been here for, I don't know, or in somebody's possession for 30 years at least. Still works like new. I get a good leg workout from it. Makes me look extra thick with like five C's. And um, you know, even though the console thing is broken, you don't need it. You just need the pedals and the pressure adjustment. That's it. That's what you need. And then, uh, yeah, um, I know it was a small, disappointing video, but you know what's more disappointing? I am literally talking to a camera by myself in my gym basement. Yep. Okay, guys, that was the video. Uh, make sure to like and subscribe and share with everyone because I'm trying to make it big as a fitfluencer on YouTube. So if you can do that, that would be nice. Um, and uh, I, I might do a workout video if you do that, okay? Okay? Yes. Yes, you will do that. All right, guys, have a good one. Stay safe during the coronavirus. And um, wear, wear a mask, because you're ugly. I'm just, I'm just trying to get my job done.